There you go. Okay, guys, I'm back. There we go with the chat. I'm sorry, guys. This technology stuff is driving me out of this world. <laughs> I'm sorry. I probably delete the first one and just, you know, keep you guys, um, leave this one up after we finish. Um, it's quite a bit of things I have here to share with you. I also have a little news to share with you also. Hi, Linda. I, I was trying to go live before, and for some reason, I wasn't seeing the chat, so I had to go off and come back again. So thank you for coming back if you were there and I didn't see you. Hi, Judy. Um, yeah, so thank you, guys. I mean, it's been almost two weeks since I have done something here. Some of you might know what's been going on. Some of you might not. But I'll let you know, you know, um, it's been... Um, um, I've been in Iraq with uh, my dog, you know, he's been sick and all that stuff. But unfortunately, uh, we had to put him to sleep on Saturday. So because he was getting, you know, you know, thank you, Judy. So we put him to sleep and uh, it was hard, you know, so I just had to deal with it. It was rough. Hi, Miria. How are you, sweetie? So I have a bunch of stuff. Um Judy, I got your package. It's in there. I, I've been so. I'm so sorry. I haven't even done videos. I, I was supposed to participate in a couple of challenges. I supposed to do friend mail, and because of the situation with the dog, because you guys know he's been, he's was my companion day in and day out, and um, it was um, kind of hard to let him go. So, but unfortunately, it's life. It's what we have to do. We have to deal with it. And I figure, you know, um, even with the challenges, I, I, I supposed to post a challenge yesterday for Davida Lane. She was having a challenge uh, yesterday of uh, for Halloween, uh, tear tray. Um, uh, Arlene's country craft also. She had challenges. She has two, three challenges. One for a cozy corner, um, which I they're all done. It's just that I haven't done. Hi, Karen. How are you, sweetie? So. It's been, I've been dragging my uh, my tail around like here. Fortunately enough for me, I I came across a stray cat and she's been my companion. And I just, I took her under my wing and I'm feeding her, make sure that she's fed and whatever, you know. So she comes around, she gives me company whenever she feels like it. She's a stray cat. I mean, she's okay. She goes, she only keeps herself around this area. My perimeter is here now that I'm feeding her. So I'm glad for that because I don't want her to get killed or anything by car or something, you know. Hi, Jolanda, sweetie. How are you? Yeah, I was uh, telling them about the situation with my dog. So we we decided uh, I got a piece of, of his tail. They gave me a little bag with some of his hair. Hi, Davida, sweetheart. So I got that. I'm going to do once they, my daughter didn't want, I didn't want the ash. It, I didn't want to keep the ashes, but my daughter was having a hard time too. She wanted to have the ashes, so she paid for it. And we're expecting for them to call me so I can we can have them. So... What I decided to do was, um, once we get the, the urn, we're going to take the other dog that passed away also because I had two dogs, and both of them, unfortunately, I had to put them to sleep. I am going to um, put them in that I have a tall shelf in, in my living room. We have flowers. And, um, you know, I have it decorated. So I'm going to take two pictures with the urn, and I'm going to put them up there, and I'm going to make a, like a shadow box with my, my king's hair that they gave me the little piece of hair they gave me and I'm going to do it and keep it in there with uh, his picture. So, uh, you know, in remembrance of them, I mean, we have to let them go. Unfortunately they're here temporarily. We all are, you know, so sometimes you, you search and in your mind, I was, I was, I was texting back and forth with a friend and sometimes you search where, why, why this, why that? But you know, the more I think about it, it's for not, not for us not to know. It's just for us to accept it and with the hope that we someday will meet them, we we'll meet with them again. And it's a hard thing to, a conclusion to come to, but you know what? Thank you, Davida. Hi, Katzel. So it is what it is, and we just have to deal with 
would take the, the hump and jump over and go to the next one. But anyway, that being out of the way, let's go to good things. I have a lot of things to share with you guys. I think I think I went overboard this time because I was so down. So I, my husband, my daughter, everybody took me out to shop because they know I love to shop and look for good sales. Yeah, I'm okay, Judy. I'm going to be mailing you stuff sometime this week. I have it there. I just, like I said, everything is here. I just, you know, there's some days you just... This, it was more than one day. I just couldn't get myself motivated to do anything. I just, my daughter will make food. I didn't want to eat or anything like that. I just pick on little things here and there. So one of those things. But anyway, I can I can use that uh, weight loss, you know. <laughs> no, it's okay. I just, you know, I, I, I like to keep things in perspective, Judy. You know, I like to see, you know. Yeah, well, I have, I'm surrounded, it's, as you see. I have stuff that I bought because I want to make some pumpkins. I did a bunch of uh, wreath for my door, you know, in between trying to keep myself occupied. Uh, they're hanging. When I do my home tour, you guys will see it. I can probably show you some pictures that I took on my phone. You might not be able to appreciate them as well as when I do the home tour. Uh, I had to do Davida's uh, up, uh, upload of the tray for Halloween. It's, it's done. It's, it's done like two to three. I did it a while back. Uh, the same thing with Arlene Country Crafts. Hers was last week, and I didn't upload anything. <laughs> Just one of those those two weeks has been like racket, you know? So anyway, I'm glad I'm able to see the chat. And the first one, I couldn't see the chat. I said, okay. So I'm going to communicate. So I have to get out and come back in. So anyway, let me start with Hobby Lobby. So you guys, you know, uh, I see there's 10 people here with me. Thank you for coming and joining me and giving me support. Uh, this I need this more than anything today. Trust me. It's one of those days, even though I have my daughter, my my husband, my daughter was feeling down too. I don't know if it's a, compl a complications of thing. Yeah, I don't know. I really don't know. But life is life. Let's go. Let's go to Hobby Lobby. And I had Tuesday morning. I picked twice. I picked things from here and there. Uh, but it's a whole, it's going to go, whatever I grab, that's what I'm going to show. I'll tell you what it's from. It's not going to be in a specific order. Right now, I'm going to start with Hobby Lobby. And uh, this is one of the things I think I picked up. This is not from Hobby Lobby. This is from someplace else. <laughs> okay. Let's start with Christmas, guy. I picked this up. I, I, I have um, a gingerbread village that I do every year, and I keep adding maybe a year from them. Last year, I didn't have much, and I picked this up at 40%, and I got him. It's a little thing to be part of the village, so I'm going to be putting him in there. This was $7.99, but it was 40% off, so like $3, $3.40, dollars $3 something like that. But it has the little thing it moves around, and it's like, uh, I will say, like four inches tall. So I got that. I got the missus with a little cute bow. The same thing. $7.99, 40% off. Adorable to do a vignettes or do the, the trays, you know, the, the, the three-tier trays. So look how adorable they look together. I'm, I have to move this way. I forget the camera's here, guys. <laughs> Thank you, Linda. Then this fellow... They're all three. Let me put them together. Look at him. I don't know if he's a Santa Claus, the Papa, or wow, the Papa and the, the, the two kids. I don't know what happened to the mama. I didn't see her there, so I didn't pick her up. So I got this, the same price, $7.99, 40% off. Then I went with my daughter. She was there with me, too, so she helped me pick this up. And look at how cute. This is like the cocoa. Look, at me. that's similar to what you make, girl, except that yours look nice. They look real, but this look at how, how nice it is. The shimmer in here and this. I have a lot of projects that I want to do, and I haven't done nothing. I just be dragging myself around. This one was $14.99, 40% off, kind of pricey, but it's cute. It's part of, for the village. It would be nice to put around. I wanted it. I picked it up, and then I picked up this. You know, everybody with their trucks and whatever. It says gingerbread, and it lights up. Look at the little gingerbreads here and here. And it says here, let me see if I can see. Gingerbread diner, today's special cookie, $1, cake, $2. And it has all the gingerbreads here, if you can see them. And this is like, a, like I will say like five, let me see, like six inches wide. 
and it has the little peppermint back here. I think it was cute addition. It has the Christmas lights over here. I think it was a nice addition for my gingerbread, which you guys will see uh, once I do the Christmas stuff. I mean, we're just ahead of ourselves, but he put this back here so it doesn't break and move it out of the way so I can make room for more. Okay. Next, this creamery I picked it up, I think was in uh, was in Marshall's. One of those places, a Ray Dunn creamery, creamer, creamer, that. Okay, I'll put it over here somewhere so it doesn't break. Okay, let me continue with Hobby Lobby. Ugh. Here we go. There's certain pieces that I keep in mind. Hi, Lorraine, how are you, sweetie? Welcome, honey, welcome. I just started showing some of this stuff. Uh, I just started, so I was talking about them to what happened to my dog. So um, I picked this two fellows. I, this was $21.99, was 40% off. Oops, something fell. His sets had the gingham here. Well, he's so adorable. He has a little shovel here and a little flower, the sunflower. You know, this year, sunflower heaven. I love sunflowers for this time of the year. Sit. Sit. <laughs> then I got the girl. I mean, there was uh, like $10, $11, I will say each, but they're pretty big. You know, they're not little like the other ones. And this is the girl. That's her face. She has a little oak leaf there. Little ponytail. I might do some bows and put it over here. But she's adorable. It's made out of, you know, the raffia and the this fabric here. I'll sit. So I think they were cute together. I'll put them in my, I have a, a little red wagon. I figure I'll put them together, the red wagon, when I'm ready to decorate, something like that. So I got them. Let me see, I'll put them here. Oops. Stay. Then I got a little pumpkin. This was $3.99, was 40% off, like $1.70 maybe. Or something like that. This is tiny. This is just to do when you do the vignettes and stuff, the trays or something like that. I got that one. I got two of them. Oops. The same. Let me move this guy here. And then I got this one because I tried to do things in three. I felt this was $7.99, 40%. This was like $5. I think of four dollars for something, but I like the some flowers. Says gives thanks. Love him. Look how adorable he's mad at the world. <laughs> She's mad at the world. <laughs> so I'm so sorry, guys. It's just this is kind of funny. I have to cheer myself up somehow. And I picked him up. I've been watching this guy since last year, but I never picked him up last year. So I wanted him so. He was $39.99, 40% off. So I think I paid like $23 for him. But he's adorable. He has a little robin. I'm not robin. Yeah, the robin. So a robin or a cardinal? Cardinal. I don't know. One of those birds. Um, the gifts. And he sits. So I think he's adorable. He's twisted legs. But he's pretty well made, I will say. He's like, a, I will say, like third. 13, 14 inches tall, baby. So it's pretty good. I love the, the little details he has, the birds, everything there for Christmas. So he has a present. I love this. So look who's here. My pink zebra is here. Hello. <laughs> thank you, girls. Oh, thank you. Then I picked up this guy or this girl because this was $12.99. I had the other one already I, I have shared with you guys that says welcome. It's already on the, the tray that I'm supposed to upload for the challenge. I never I have done it. So this one, that's going to go with that one on that tray. So this one was $12.99, 40%. Then I got another punk. It says give thanks. Little things to fill in spaces. So I got that. This doesn't belong here. I have my garbage can there. 
And then the last one here is this fellow. I could not find the girl, so I picked him up. They didn't have no more. They were sold out. But I said, oh, I'll pick him up. Maybe they'll next year. I'll say this. He was $13.99. And he also sits. So thank you, sweetie. Thank you. So let me put everything here and switch around to see which the next thing I'm going to pick up. Let me stuff them in here. <laughs> okay. Go here. And this fellow here. You sit. Okay. Um, I wanted to share, oops, share this. This is going to be part of my one of my trays that I finished. Because I was working on this. Oops. They work a different green and, and orange, but they say boo. I made this. This is not black. It's like a purplish color. It has like a purplish darken color. So I did this one, this one. This is a little project I was working on. So I got three of them. One says the two O's. So that's gonna go on the vignette that I have over there. I just worked. They have, I was much, much parting them. Okay, let's see. Let me pick this up. I'm gonna do the smaller version first and then we go into the big stuff. This I pick up from Walmart. Because I want to do some stuff for now for autumn. So I picked up this was, I think it's a yard. Yeah, yard it was $3.58 from, uh, from Walmart. A couple of things. I picked up a yard of it. This is like um, this is like cotton, but this one is more like a suede kind of thing, but it's not suede. It's like a polyester. I have a yard here, and this I paid a dollar fifty was on clearance. This one was more money. Figure because of the gingham square, whatever you want to call it. I picked up this brown color and I paid two dollars for this. Uh, one yard. Yeah, see where I'm going with the colors? This one and this one. So basically, the colors are the holiday color, but they stay muted, you know? This is from Walmart. And the reason I'm showing you this, I'm going to put this here because I'm working on this. I'm going to go back to Hobby Lobby because I have more stuff from Hobby Lobby here. Part of the gingerbread collection. I picked this one up from Hobby Lobby. And this was $11.99, 40%. I don't know if I have a girl or not. I don't think I had the girl. I think I'm missing some stuff. But I might find the encounter somewhere. I got that. Put over here. Then I got this little house. Let me see if it turns on. Oh, I have to pull the thing out. Really, Gloria? Where is it? Does it turn on? I guess not. Let me see. Oh, it needs batteries. Hello, Gloria. It needs battery. <laughs> but it, 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 you know, it turns on. It's just so I forgot to put batteries. It's a cute little house to add to the village. And then I've been wanting this for a couple of years. So this is going to be part of it too. And this one. It has a little train in, in the bottom. See? I'm pretty sure you guys seen it. So adorable. Last year, last year I picked up the, the little horsey. To put under the tree, but you have the you know, antennas, and it plays, it's like a village scenery. Adorable. And this one was $29.99 and 40%, so I think like $15 or $16. Isn't it adorable? I love this. I love Christmas. And so I I, I love the holidays. I, I can't help it. I, I don't, I'm running out of room. I'm going to have to move my family out and keep so I can pack all my stuff. No, I'm just kidding. Okay. I don't know if I have any more from there. If I come across it, I'll, I'll tell you guys. Anyway, let me. I have this small version here. If you notice, I'm all over the place. Sorry for this, this waggy thing. This is from Walgreens. We went the other day to Walgreens to pick up some stuff. And I, you know how I like pens? So I picked this up. Mickey Mouse. For the Halloween stuff, $3.99. So this is for my daughter. 
she lost her Mickey Mouse, so oops, it blinks. And it's a flashlight. See? So you can turn it on. And it was $3.99. I picked that up. And of course, I picked him up. Uh, he doesn't do anything. He was a dollar ninety-nine. Hi, Mary. And then I picked up this one, one ninety-nine. They just pens. You know, I collect pens. Look how cute. Let me see. They don't, I don't think they, oh, they do. They light up. Does this one light up too? Oh yes, it does. Look, I didn't even realize they light up. Ooh, that's annoying. Awesome for the for the for Halloween. I should pick a couple more, send it to my grandkids. They will love that. And then I found this adorable owl. It was $2.99. This is at Walgreens. But look, they're, they're using the caps, the bottle caps. This is wood, wood table decor. And um it's like very antique the way they did it, but he's so cute. Like the pens, I Walgreens, Linda Walgreens. <laughs> Karen, tell your husband that don't worry about it. That we can fit twelve people in a Volkswagen. We we take care of everything else. Tell him to sit, relax, bring the money in. That's all. <laughs> but I think this round. I didn't even when I bought them. I didn't even think they did this until now. <laughs> But look how this one cute. My daughter is up. I don't know if I'm gonna go or not next uh, next Friday uh, to Disney. She's gonna go for the Halloween stuff. I might get courage, but it depends on the doctor. Talking about that, I did get an injection. Um, um over here, remember I was telling you about the bra, the, my my arm. They gave me an injection, but they want MRI on my neck and my lower back to see where the stage is of my stuff. Anyway, hi Leah, welcome. Hey, you have to be funny, right? Enjoy your soul. You have to become a kid. Everything can be sadness. Uh, this is my favorite. I like this one. <laughs> Look at me. I'm turning all red. That's that. Then I went to Joanne's. Yeah. Here's a bag. This is from today. This has been a collection of two weeks, guys. It's not only one week. I go in on that. I went to Joanne's in search. I also I went to Joanne's, and I also... I have a bunch of stuff here. Anyway. They were having a great, great sale today. And I've been meaning to pick this up. And I picked this up. So cute. This was... I cannot believe the price that this was $34.99. Let me see how much this thing pays, cost. But I got a 60% off plus uh, a 20 on top of that. Let me see. It came out to be $13.99, guys. From Joanne's. $13.99. Already $34.99 because they they gave my um they gave me a 60% off. And what was the other thing? Oh. The my husband military discount, and the girl gave me also uh, at the end they gave the twenty percent of the total purchase. So I got this. Isn't this cute? Yes, it's so cute. I saw somebody haul it. I don't know if it was Arlene or it was Kim. I watch so many channels. I don't know that I love to, to watch everybody do different stuff. But I fell in love with it. But then I didn't think about it. I was bouncing around looking for flowers and stuff. Everything. Anyway, so I went to uh, I picked this up from Joanne because Joanne and Kirkland the t we went down like the two towns down from us and uh, it went to your, then I bumped into this and it was the last one there that I saw and it's it's the um, so cute. Let's see where I'm gonna place it. You guys gonna see when I do the walkthrough. This one is almost thirteen. It's thirteen inches tall. And it has it in the bag. This is like flowers are made out of felt. These flowers are so easy to make. I went in there for one thing. I ended up with this. I didn't buy what I went in there for. The same thing happens in Kirkland. I went to pick up a, uh, a lantern. I didn't. I walked out of Kirkland without a lantern. I bought everything else except the lantern. <laughs> so there you go. They were good prices. This flower, it was on the floor. 
and my husband picked it up. I said, oh, I can use it. And we're outside, so it's there. And this came out from $34.99. It came out to $13.99. They had an extra 20% of total purchase today. I picked up a couple of more of these picks. They were $1.99, and I pay a dollar for them. Actually, maybe less because a dollar minus 10% minus 20. So probably like 70 cents each. So I picked up a couple of them. I was going to pick up the, the garland, but I said it's easier this way. So I picked up, I think, five of them. And then they were that, uh, well, 70 cents with all the discounts. I saw a couple of months ago somebody, they had all their punches are on clearance, guys. If you need punches, go to Joanne's. They have so much. I said, I can't even look because I have too many punches here. I think I have basically almost all of them. The, basically, the basics that you need, that's what I'm trying to say. Like some flowers or flowers or uh, stars or animals. So basic, you know. So. What was that? Well, you know, Joanne's, it's funny. I was telling my husband to the one we were at Joanne's. I was telling him, you know, Joanne's triple the prices. And then when they put things on sale, you're actually paying... Unless you have an extra 20, you're actually paying the regular price that you, something will cost. Like something like this would be $14, $15 uh, at maybe Michael's or Hobby Lobby, if they have it. They don't have this. But I don't think they have this. Blue. I think Hobby Lobby does. And you end up paying the price. But this one, I pay for this one. This is like the envelope. The mini envelope, even though I had the board, mini board envelope, right, Linda? I searched for that thing. Now I got the punch. This is a punch. And I paid for this one. Let me see how much I paid. I went to Joanne's also looking for the uh, Christmas Tim Holtz stuff. Oh, my God, guys, you have, if you haven't seen Tim Holtz Christmas stuff, if you do cards or you do mixed media, you, you have to check them out. Uh, let me see how much I paid for this Fisker thing. Uh... It was $15.99, um, came out to $11.99, and then out of that, you get the 20% and the 10% off. So it came out like $9, nine, $9 maybe, or $9 or $10 or something like that. But I think this will save a lot of time to make mini envelopes. <laughs> Look at it, Linda. You have to get yourself one of this, Linda. Go to Joanne's, guys. They have these coupons, but this is all in the custom frame. Let me see. 50%. This starts um, sun, set, Wednesday, September 23rd to the 26th. The 50%. And, of course, guys, you know they take uh, those uh, competitors, competitors coupons. Yeah. Like if, if I can get them full mount. Okay, let me show you what, I, uh, what else I got. Then I saw... This adorable cat. Let me take this out because this glare is driving me nuts. This is a chalkboard. And I saw it when I was at the register, when I was walking by, you know, near the register. And I fell in love with it. So I figure if I put it in one of my trays, I can write down here with chalk to uh, 31st. It's a little step thing. See, he adorable. And he was $2.99. And uh, all Halloween's were 40% uh, off, I think. Or 40, let's see, Halloween was 50% off and the extra 20. So this cost me like pennies, basically. 50% will be a dollar fifty. So I'm assuming it cost me like maybe a dollar seventy-five or something. <laughs> it's a Linda, something else. You made me laugh, Linda. Okay, now to the Tim Holtz stuff. This is what this is the Halloween stuff, guys. This is, uh, I haven't seen this, but let me show you. Let me take it out of the bag, because this is, that glare drives me nuts. This is the pack of uh, Halloween vignette box tops. That's what it's called. Let's see what it has. So they're the little boxes. So they're already cut for you. All you have to do is make the boxes. 
See? So scored for Halloween. So basically, you do the same thing. You open, the, you use it as a template. Do this for the bottom part. Take cardboard for the bottom part and put this over. I think this was meant to go with something else, but you have to buy a separate. But I love the cat. Look how cute. And this one says, uh, color bright custom with ventilated mask. That's what it says there. Everything is backwards. So I got that one. This one. This has like a pumpkin in the middle. Inside. So it has a bunch. It's like a uh, cardboard thing. <laughs> Do I need to come to you? Yeah, really, Glinda. This one, it says bright night. So they're Halloween stuff. I mean, look at the big one. And this one. So it has two big ones like this. This medium one. And let's see, two medium ones and a little one. So it has five in total. Oops. Okay, let's see. Five pieces in total. I don't know what did I pay for this. Let me see. And I paid. I can buy the receipt. Oh, here it is. Tim Holtz, Ephemera Park. It was four ninety nine uh, minus two dollars, so it was two ninety nine, and then the twenty percent. Uh, yeah, the twenty percent. Uh, take at the end. So they took uh twenty percent off. Yeah, twenty the twenty percent. Okay, so that's that. Then I got this one. That has all the ephemera, and the ephemera was four ninety nine minus two ninety nine, so it was minus three dollars. Two dollars I paid for this, and twenty percent off of the two dollars. Round it off to the nearest dollar, you know. What you guys been doing all weekend? Anything new? Let me. Pull this ephemera out so you guys can see. Look how adorable. You don't even have to put the 30 for, you know, you can put this here with some double sided tape, the 31st on the cat, or put it on the tail. 31st here and make a little bow here and make eyes for the cat with, with a chalk and put it on the little thing. This is like an orangey red. So adorable. Yeah, Linda, you're working. So you got the 31st. Femora has this. This little tiny thing is an eye. He has this the poison word, a little sticker, poison. Has a skeleton. I don't know what happened to him. He needs like a something to play the drums. <laughs> This is a bigger version, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, this bigger. He's funny looking. The moon is mad at the world. Check it out. <laughs> you still organizing, Judy, huh? Girl, I reorganize this thing again. So, I mean, everything is still in place. I haven't moved anything around. But I went into the closet, reorganized it. I did I, I did that big thing back there and I moved things around because I want to be able to organize, but I'm glad that you're getting there. Oh, okay. That's nice, Castle. Yeah, that's true, Mary. They have these little things. You can barely see, they're so tiny. Has this with a poison thing. More 31st. Let me see what else. The, the tiny one, I think sometimes it's just a steel. This one with a hand. Look at this one, the owl. Isn't he cute? Says, Halloween greeting. Woo, woo. Don't you wish you were you 
don't you wish you knew? It says, who, who, don't you wish you knew? That's what it says there. Right here on the lettering. Very tiny, you can barely see it. Tiny little thing poison, little thing blank. This ugly pumpkin. That's an ugly pumpkin. If they meant to make it scary, they made it ugly. <laughs> it says here, toxic. This is the one I was showing you in a little tiny, it was tiny, it's a nine. And it says, why did the druggist Nixon keep me in your mind's eye, Texas? Then it has this people, his famous people, a bingo card, another card, a ticket, uh, oh, the different parts of the bones of the face, witch pin steel, more tickets, the, the parts of the body, the skeleton. Okay, another thing here, another ticket. I keep moving to the right, and I mean, you guys, the, the, the camera's over here. <laughs> this owl, this ugly witch, she needs to go to the dentist. <laughs> A small owl, a big owl. This one is cute. This pumpkin is cute. See? Why well, can't they make all of them like that? Uh, the hurts, the old fashioned way. Coffins, casket, who wants to know about that? The freaking cat that he stuck his paw on the socket so he got electrocuted. <laughs> what pins are you talking about? Those? Judy? These? Those are the, you know, the caddy, the, the caddy that you, um, that you roll around the little cart? Not the cat, smaller. I had it in the car, that I kept bumping into them, so I put them there. <laughs> I put things out. And then these stickers that I had, that you see they're sticking there? I got those two pieces. There's two pieces, those white uh, uh, cubbies. They're two pieces, and I got them at Target on a sale three weeks ago. And I bought, they had the, the, those, the, the, the bins are the fiber thing. They're very heavy. They're strong enough to hold heavy stuff, like my, some, the rest of my, um, laces. And I put laces in there. I have, I have to write the names of each of them. I haven't had a time. I just, and then the stickers, I got them, was it Dollar Tree or Hobby Lobby? No, Dollar Tree or Tuesday morning, those color stickers. This one's, uh, this one's there. So, and technically, even though they have glue, they would not stick. So I use my glue, my, this glue. I use this glue to stick it there because otherwise they would not stay. So this is the, the art glitter glue. Love that stuff. That's the best glue they ever invented. And then another owl, wicked. A hand, another card, the witch is flying, spooky words. I'm doing that with Jen's crazy life. She's teaching me, how, well, she's teaching everybody, not me only, how to do uh, junk journals with uh, with old books. So I didn't have a lot of stuff. Look at this cat. Oh, my God. What are you doing? He's <laughs> surprised. Okay. <laughs> Enough of the silly jokes. Another comedian, another owl. This this certificate, I guess, and another guy there with sad face. And I'm not gonna go through all that because just repeated the little ones. Okay, so that's that. That's ephemera. I don't want to bore you guys with that. Let me put this up. Oops, I have a mixture of uh, crafting stuff here, and um, oh my god, these little pieces are bad to pick. And uh, household decor. You know, I do a little bit of everything, guys. You know me. Everything and anything. I love art. Anything that has to do with art and thinking about it and expressing yourself in the form of art. Love it. Okay. 
I was watching uh, a thing on YouTube about these people that there's like 10 people in the whole world that they can remember everything that happened in their lives from the age of 12 to uh, from the, when once they turn 12, 12 to 13 to 14, they develop this thing is because their front lobe is enlarged. So they remember everything, dates and everything. Okay, so this one was, this femur was $4.99 minus $2.99. Then I got this paper. This is Halloween. Let me open this one. I need. I haven't seen this one. They had a good sale of the dilution stamps. I'm gonna show you them in a second. Oh my God, this paper is so awesome. It's nice. So it has two of these. Let's see. Yeah, two of these. This is like a wallpaper type thing. Look at the roses here. Two of these. Beautiful paper. And it's so nice. It feels like uh, like fabric, but it's not fabric, it's paper. This one, two of those. Two of these. You don't have, they give you the pictures, but you don't appreciate them unless you, you see the pe actual paper. Two of these. Two of these. They're sticking together. Two of these. Two of these. You haven't said any uh, hello to somebody. I uh, just uh, forgive me. I just trying to look at the chat at the same time. Try to keep going with this. Otherwise, we'll be here all night. Two of these. Two of these. This one, love it. Look how pretty. And this is all Halloween. Wait until you see the Christmas one. Oh my God, he was showing the Christmas one. I said, I want one of that, one of that, one of that, like I need it. So that's that. This one has 24 pieces of five inches by eight inches. The, the, the sheets. Pretty paper. I'll be showing what I'm going to do with that later, I guess. Okay, got that. And then I found the last things I found from Joanne's. At least what I have here. I picked up this of the clearance bins. Look at this butterfly, guys. Oh, let me take it out of here. It's just that clear. It's not going to let you guys see. And this is by Rangers Illusions Clear Stamps. It was two dollars and forty-seven cents, guys. Two dollars and forty-seven cents. I'm trying to get rid of the glare, but it's hard. Let me see. No. That's better. Yeah, that's better. You check it out. See. You have the, the wings and the, the it looks like a little girl. Feathers and this. And the octopus thing. So that, oops, 2047 cents. I'll pick it up later. Then I got, where'd it go? Hmm. Oh, here it is. So, and I picked up that one. Picked up this one for 2047 cents. This is also dilution. And this was originally, it doesn't say how much it was originally. I think it was like six dollars. That better. As the flowers. I see if I pick that up. And then I have two more to show you. This one says believe, has flowers and things. The camera is trying to pick it up, you know? So this one has six pieces. This one has how many pieces? 
set the the one with the flower has seven pieces this one oh it looks better this way and this is the one oops if i put it next to my black shirt or bring this shirt it looks better let me put this in here i'm sorry guys i have to put it in there because i don't have no room here okay And then he has this one. I think, can you see it better? Yeah, 247, definitely, Judy. 247 for them. One, the, the flower one has seven pieces. And this other one that says Believe has uh, six pieces. The butterfly has seven pieces. And this one is so adorable. It has a fox, it has a bunny, a deer, and an owl, and some other pieces there. I guess the parts of the animal. Check it out. The owl, the deer, the fox, the rabbit. I guess this, that's the rabbit's tail. This is the fox tail, the deer tail, and I guess the owl's tail. 247 guys. I was shocked when I saw that price. So let me put this over here. Get it out of the way. Okay. Next. The, you see here the free flower. Put it over here. Doesn't fall too wet. Okay. Now, let's see. Oh, one thing I got from Costco, and this thanks to Arlene's Country Craft. You know, I, I don't know if you've seen her channel, if you're familiar with her channel. She makes awesome decorations too. And today, I was it today or yesterday, she was showing that her husband went to bring a car to fix the tires, the, her daughter's car or something like her daughter's car, the tires to be replaced. And so he was walking around and he came across this. This thing is 40, if a $40 value, and if you need candles, this is the this is the way to go to Costco. It was $19.99 and it has LED, it has five LED wax candles with remote control and programmable timer. And the company name is Mirage. Not only that, and they flicker very nice. So it has this big one, two of these ones, and two of the uh, well, I guess two medium, one large, and two smaller ones. And not only that, it has 20 Duracell batteries included. And they're underneath here. And they they don't move, but they do flicker because Arlene tested them. If you go to Arlene's channel, uh, you can see her her last video. She's showing them how they build. So I say, I have to go and get them because mine are getting old. And what I like about them is the timer. You put it on timer, you don't have to worry about it. And it has a, a control remote too. And it comes with the batteries for each bat uh, for each uh, uh, thing, 20. So I figure if it's 20, it's five here, it's two. I guess you have extra. I'm not sure if it takes two or three. But I think it takes, let me see, one remote control, including blah, 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 lithium bottom batteries, 20 Duracell AA alkaline batteries. And it says up to 350 hours battery run time. Customize your candle to turn on and off at the same time every day. And I mean, what else can you do? Look how nice. 20 bucks, guy. Yeah, they look, they look, uh, when they move, when you turn them on, they look real. I don't know if you can see it. Why is this camera doing that? There, focus. See? That's an idea. This is a $40 deal for $20, $19.99. Girl, I wanted to buy two, but I said, you don't need two. So he was with me. He tried to say, <clears throat> okay, let me do this. This is just something I, out of the ordinary. When we were going out, they were having a garage sale. So I picked this up for $2. Little basket. And I picked this up. But instead of putting magazines, and this is wood, guys. Oh, I also picked up this uh, Costco. 40, 40 batteries for 
So you, that's the best place to get batteries, guys. Anyway, I picked this up for five bucks. So I don't know if I'm gonna keep it this color or what, but I'm gonna, instead of using it for magazine, I'm gonna put my, my, my blankets in here in the living room. That's what I'm gonna do. That's that. So, those ideas, it doesn't, you don't have to use this where they're meant to be. Okay, let's go to Kirkland's and then we go to Burlington. Then the last one is gonna be Tuesday morning. I picked up three more of these garlands. You've seen them before. They were $6.98 each. I have the other ones up. These ones are for other stuff I still have to do. So three of them for $6.98. You know what a garland looks like. Okay, let me put this back here. Ugh. Then I picked up this boo, oops, I'm going to be putting this over here, and they were running a sale, it was $16.99, and it was 50, like eight bucks, pretty big, it doesn't turn on on anything, but I figure I can put lights over here, and make it light up, little twinkly lights, it's pretty big, it's, it's like, uh, this has 13 here, it's like 15 inches wide, but you see the the, the little bat over here, the reef over here, the spider, and it has the little uh, raven there. Very solid piece. And I have shared with you guys the smaller size of this. So I got this one. This is you can put candles in here. You just turn turn this and put a, a candle in there on the side. And this was originally $14.99. And I think she I used a coupon. Let me see how much I pay for that. Yeah. She gave she went crazy giving me coupons that she was supposed to, but she did. Okay. The garden's work came out to be $502 because. Why was it because, uh, let's see. They gave me a discount, let me see. Holiday promo, which was 40% and 10% military discount. So I got a uh, discount of total $17.58 and I pay $18.63. So let's see, the garlands were $502. For one and six twenty eight for the other because I have to do different chef actions so I can use the the, the coupon. Then the 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 boost sign was sixty ninety nine. I ended up paying nine seventy eight plus tax, of course. I say seven dollars and twenty one cents. And then the. The galvanized tin was uh, was originally fourteen ninety nine. I paid. Uh, they gave me. Uh, it came out to ten twelve, and they gave me a, a discount twenty five percent off, plus one dollars and twelve cents off. So I yeah, I ended up paying ten dollars and and twelve cents in total for that little house. So it wasn't bad. So I spent there like uh, forty dollars. That's that. Okay. Let's do this big stuff. This is Burlington Co Factory. They were having stuff going on too. I picked this up. And this was $10.99. I have to be careful because I had to ask stuff here. Let me see if I can use this. No, well then. Hold well on, guys. Ah, uh, yeah, me too. I love Kirkland. I can I can do damage on that store. Trust me. Who do you see? Because this is glass. I know I didn't I didn't unravel it, even though I hate the unraveling, because I'm not afraid that I break something. So sorry about the unraveling. I picked this up. This was five dollars and ninety nine cents. Great price. 
Let me use the basket for something. I picked up this adorable swan. It's a, a, a piggy bank, I guess. <laughs> Especially when you go into a rag, right, Davida? <laughs> Well, isn't she isn't this adorable? This was yesterday. I picked this up. It was uh, already six. Well, it's six dollars and ninety nine cents, but I think it's adorable. So this is gonna go in this room. I broke so many things trying to change things around, guys. You have no idea. Everything falls. The one of the faces that I had the cups that I had the my pens in that had a little face that I had gotten in Target a long time ago fell and it went into pieces. I said, oh well. Something to be replaced. Then got this one. And what I like it, it says, trick or treat yourself. <laughs> the unicorn was that. <laughs> trick or treat yourself, okay? I'm a unicorn girl. <laughs> and it's purple inside. I fell in love with this. I had I had to pick it up. You <laughs> know. And I was out to the whole store. I mean, people were looking at me like I was nuts. <laughs> I had my girlfriend and my her husband were with us because we went out to dinner there last night. <laughs> and of course, you know, you're looking for trick-or-treat stuff. And then the unicorn is telling you, trick-or-treat yourself, okay? Girl. <laughs> that was so funny. I had to just pick that up. That's so cute. Hey, what do they say? In the bad weather, you have to look the best, honey. You put some makeup on and you keep going. I told you, I, I you know, it's so funny you say that, Davida, because the doctor looks at me and he's he's testing because he does they do tests and stuff like that. He's pressuring he's like, oh, because he hurts. And they can see the pain in my eyes. If you look, you can see it. But you put makeup on, it makes such a big difference. I don't know who was a psychologist or psychiatrist that. That they they when when you're in school I, they used to say when you're down you lift yourself up take a nice shower relax take deep breath uh, make yourself beautiful somehow or at least try if you are not then keep going but thank you for the compliment my dear then I picked this one up that says happy Halloween and this one was three ninety nine. Great prices in Burlington, but look how cute for Halloween. Where do you get something so cute like this? Only me. And the other one, let me see how much. I didn't say the price about this. Yeah, this one was $3.99 too. I got that. I mean, be careful because I like to break stuff. Let me put it in the basket. Red Riding Hood. Then. I do I have, oh, here is the other bag. What can I say? I picked this up from my husband for Christmas. It's going to look awesome in this color, a nice suit. And this was $16.99. And uh, it's by Adrian Vitadini, whatever his name is or her name. And then I picked up this, and that was $16.99. It says here, pumpkin spice and everything nice. This was $5.99, this little sign. And you know I collect this kind of things. These are the two little cats. They're so, let me check a pic. I guess the black cat is the pepper, and the other one, let me see if I can get it out so you don't see the glare. Let me Look at how adorable. I don't like that all the other stuff, the Halloween, but I think they were precious. Aren't they cute? This is the salt and this is the pepper shaker. And all their stuff for Halloween. Look at the little tail. Salt and checker. You see, this is pepper, this is salt. So cute. And this was $3.99. 
And one more thing. Let me put this back. Or, you know, glass breaks. There are, though, I like that, you know, I normally don't like that uh, scary stuff, that Dia de los Muertos and stuff like that, but this ki kitties were cute, so I picked them up. And then I have one more thing here, let me see. And this is lead flavorless candle. And this one was... $7.99 for this one, originally $15. It was basically half price. But it's like a like a wax kind of feeling. But I think it was this ghost was kind of cute. So that was that for Burlington. You guys all that stuff with Florence. My daughter and, and some of her co-workers, they're doing if you go to Facebook, you'll see that thing, my Facebook. If you look under my name, you'll see it. Um, they're doing collection for the people in uh, New Jersey because a lot of their, their co-workers in North Carolina and South Carolina got affected by the hurricane. And they're doing uh, collections of goods, you know, like clothing or food, whatever they're doing. And then you see, they, she, she puts three different addresses. You can send it to if you want. Just saying. Okay, one more thing from Burlington. <laughs> One more thing. I went crazy these past two weeks. The depression got to me, guys. <laughs> That's good depression. You go shopping. <laughs> Check her out, guys. Is she sexier? Well, they had it in purple and they had it in pink. With this pink. And look how adorable. Isn't this kitty beautiful? She's going to go on my sofa. Look at her feather. How sexy she is. <laughs> oh my goodness. She's pretty much she sits. Very pretty. This one was how much were you? Oh I don't remember. She was $12.99, I think it was. Yeah. Yeah, $12.99. Boy, do I have a good brain. Look at the little hat and everything. $12.99. Then I got three more cups. And these are Halloween related. Check her out. Cynthia Adorable. $3.99. I don't have that many Halloween stuff. Davida, wait till you see what I did with the... Uh, the, the thing I did for your challenge that I got this one with a cat. It says Happy Halloween. This was also $3.99. This is a, big, a bigger mug, wider, I shall say. And then, sorry about the crinkling, guys. Otherwise, things will break. I hate it. It gives me the chili chili. And the last cup is this one. And this one says, Which better have my candy? The witch. You see? Better have my candy. <laughs> I try to go around different. It's the only way of diversion that I had. Yeah, well, this is going to go as part of your, um, another tray that I have the three-tier tray. So, so that's the last thing from Burlington. Let me put my cat in here. See, I told you guys, see, it's empty. Remember all those flowers? I filled this up twice and it's empty. I have to, I'm going to be doing something for outside, but they put the mulch. I, finally, my husband put the mulch, so now I can get to decorate how I want it. So all this stuff is going to put away. Now, let me go to Tuesday morning. Ah, I forgot the pillow, right? This is going to go in my sofa. 
So that's that. Okay, let's go to Tuesday morning. Now, everything now is orange, burnt orange in my house and purple black. Those are the colors that I chose to decorate for Halloween slash fall. For Thanksgiving, I'm gonna be doing similar colors, except that I'm gonna keep the orange, but the table, the table scapes, they're gonna change a little bit. Cause I'm gonna be using green. I got picked this up on Tuesday morning for $10 each. This is great linen. These are uh, Elite hemp stitch tablecloth and they're 100% cotton and 45 polyester. And I love the stitching on this. You can even use this any time of the year, even for, this, for, for spring you can use them. But once you put this on and you put, I put the runner with the pumpkins, it will look nice, $10 each. I have to table, so pick that up. Carefully, let me pick this up, this is glass. This piece, how does this go? Okay, like this. This goes like this. This was $12.99. This goes similar to the ones I picked up from Pier 1. Remember Pier 1, last, last haul that I do, I did? I love green for, you know, mixing. Where's the other one? Just be careful because I, I like to break things. <laughs> then I pick this one. This is a taller one. Oops, so cool. This is a color, the greens and the browns and the burn yellow. Like, you know. Once you mix it in with the flowers and everything, they'll look good. So this is the other one, and this is the other one. And I have a smaller one. This is gonna go on my uh, coffee table with a tablescape for, that's for November, basically. There's one more. Is this the one? Okay. It's in here, the little one. Is this the Okay, this is the little one. So you get this one, the little one. I can't pick up the three of them, they're too big. So that's how you get. So these are gonna go in the, I don't know if I can pick them up, let's see. So you guys can see it, see? Love these colors together. This was $12.99, and you can put a little tea light in here, or you can even put, I'm thinking of putting fairy lights inside. That's what I'm thinking. And then the little one was $6.99, and this one's $14.99. So let me put this back here. I don't want them to break. Be nice. Okay. Then I picked up, I found this. This is also so, so on checker. I, I collect them, so. <laughs> Not the peppers and salt. Where's the, my scissors? What did I do with them? Oh, here they are. These are cute. These are the witch's leg and the cauldron. So when, you, when I do my house tour, Keep, keep focus on the little detail, the little decorations, because there's little details in each of them. Like you might see the whole spectrum, but in each spectrum, there's little curiosities in there for you to see how you can put things. It's not just putting it there. Make make a scene or make a story. That's the way. But this is one. This is the little witch's leg. It has the holes there. I think this is the pepper. <laughs> the clothing is so cute. 
<laughs> Look at the color. This is the, the salt. So it goes like this. Isn't this adorable? So uh, this is the salt. I know the salt because the salt has three holes and the pepper has two. Adorable little witches. I have one that's big like this that sits there to put candy. So that's that. You know, my daughter, for the 4th of July, I have bought, what did I buy? I think it was Dollar Tree, the Blue Owls. She bumped into one and broke one. So that will never come back again. So and we never picked up another set. So that was that. So that's the other thing. And this is all Tuesday morning. And this was... Let's see if I can put this together here. Uh, $4.99 for this one. And then I have this. This is so cute. Look at him. And he turns on. Oops, wait. I'm covering him. He changes color. Isn't she pretty pretty? Did I miss anybody? Say hello. Hello, everybody. Hello. If I miss somebody, big hugs. So I picked this up. And this one was $12.99. It has that. I don't know why they put that cape on it, but. Whatever. I guess it brings the light. Let me see. See? And it changes color. And the pumpkin too. $12.99. You know, stuff, you know, where are you gonna get those prices? Though Tuesday morning lately they're being a little expensive. I noticed is they're doing a dollar to a quarter. Like the things that were one forty a dollar, now they're one forty nine. Things that were $2.99, they're three, uh, $3.49 now. So they're doing like in 75 cents increment and a dollar increment. That's how they're doing it. But you don't feel it too much. So that's that. Put this in here in this bag. The I hate bags. I don't know why, but I hate bags. <laughs> okay. Don't break. Stay there. Okay. Ben, what did I pick this up from? Let me see. I don't remember where I picked this up. To tell you the truth, I picked this up. I don't know if it was. What's it? Oh, Hobby Lobby. I picked this up. And this was 40% off on $9.99. Uh, $9 like a little basket to put things in here. So, pick that up. Okay, last two bags. Let me see where I'm gonna put this. So it doesn't break. Okay. Stay there. Okay. All right. Everybody's been showing this. And I, I said I'm gonna go to Tuesday morning yesterday. I went and I, I went and found the DIY craft dollar forty nine originally four ninety nine. These are pumpkins, the felt. I found these uh, library cards for dollar forty nine. <laughs> Sorry. Hi, Michelle. Found these. These are like leaves. Like a like a purple, they had glitter, but the bag doesn't let you see the glitter. This one has so dollar forty nine has forty counts. This one has how many counts? Twelve library cards, and this one has thirty count pumpkin. Do packet letters you can put in there. Picked up the snowflakes for dollar forty nine. 30 counts. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff you can do with that. Picked up the bulls. Uh, $1.49. It has 30 counts. I don't know if you guys want the numbers or not, but you do let me know. 
picked up the felt lights. Dollar forty nine. This one has thirty counts. Then I picked up this spider web. This has uh, forty count for dollar forty nine. I don't know if you can see it. Just spider webs, you know, like little, it, it looks like ephemera. Found the poinsettias, felt for poinsettia, $1.49, and the leaves. Picked up more orange leaves, they have glitter, $1.49. <clears throat> the silver uh, snowflakes. Look how cute. If you take this one and you put it over this one, it will look nice. But this one is smaller than this one. Make like a double thing, make a tag with them, or put it on a pocket letter, or make a, a, like some type of picture. I mean, I can picture so many things with this. I can take a canvas and make a nice scenery with this by itself. Oh. Then I picked up, these are Hollies, I think. Yeah, these are Hollies. I haven't seen anybody hold this, but these are Hollies. This has 40 of them. I mean, I'm pretty sure you can get a template and make it, but if it's cut for $1.49, you get 40, you know? Pick the, two of these, $2.99, and these are like a chalkboard. Uh, and this is what the example, they give you like a thing, you can do things like that. But I, when I was thinking about this, I was thinking about the junk journal. You know how sometimes you make a space to put pictures, you can put pictures. You can attach this and on the side, on the three sides to the page and they can slide in, take this and slide in or they can even put the picture here. That's what I was thinking when I picked this up and it has four. And this was $2.99, a little pricey for that, but I picked up two of those. This is the other one. And one is, let me see, it has one, two, three, four, it has four. One is gold, green, red, and pink. So, I mean, you can even paint this and write a message here. Wouldn't it be nice in the book? Hi, Sarah, sweetheart. Miss you, miss talking to you. Hi, Aina. Let's go all this stuff so we can do the exchange for the chubby chic. Let me know. I know I, I talked to you. I mean, I was telling them about my dog earlier. You guys didn't hear it, but uh, my dog, I put my dog to sleep. So that's why you guys haven't seen me in two weeks. <clears throat> anyway, I picked this up because I figured I have two golds, two pinks, two greens, and two reds. And you can put them in the, 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 junk, the junk journals or the books. Those, uh, what do you call those books that you guys make? Uh, you know what I mean. <laughs> then I picked up this. It's 12, uh, 4 and a quarter by 5 and 3 quarters uh, security envelopes. I mean, this also for, I'm planning to do, uh, I'm working to see if I can learn how to make those uh, junk journals that people make. I mean, it's no big deal. It's just, uh, I'm kind of weird. <laughs> this one has... Uh, let me see. It looks like it has something written too. Let's see. I thought it has some, I don't know, it has a paper in between. Or you can write on them. It's like chalkboard. Guys, I didn't I picked them out and even realize. You see, it's like chalkboard. You can write on them. See? With chalk. And they're kind of hard. How sweet is this? And it has a little closure. Yeah, it comes with this paper. So I guess you put the paper in there. I'm not sure. I guess to protect it. But it has, um, this is a nice find for people who do junk journals and they do uh, planners and stuff. This is good for them to have because you can store things in here. And you can even write on top of this because it's chalkboard. The same thing with this. And they're not that big. I mean, if, if, I guess a mini, you can put this in a mini, in a page in a mini would be nice. I'm thinking here. I know Sarah does a lot of uh, things and uh, what's her name? Jan Crazy Life does, uh, does a lot of things too like that. So 
And I don't know a lot of people there. I'll, I'll put it later. I found this big leaf. And it has orange, yellow, like a burnt orange. And this is by American Craft. And this was $2.99. Kind of look pricey. Well, it says it has 40 die cut leaves. It doesn't look like 40, but let me see. You guys, it's so, I cried and cried for my doggy. Ooh, they're like paper. Look at this. They're not like felt. I thought they were felt, but they're paper. That's a cheating. I mean, it's like a, like a printer paper. That's how it feels. It has yellows. But it's this $3 for this. Come on, this, this people. Okay, whatever. It has this one. Like an orange, like a light, a bright orange. Let me see. It has, this is pretty. This is like a burnt orange. Hold on. So it looks like, like red, but it's like a, like an burnt orange. It doesn't look, you see how bright it's showing up? But it's not, it's like real, uh, I don't know if that would make the difference. Yeah, it still looks light. And, he, and then they have these lighter ones, orange. So that's that for that one. Stay. Have you have guys ever talked to things? You like this one, Sabina? I can share. You just have to let me know where to send it. I don't know where to send things. Oh, I got picked up these bats. They felt bats. So dollar forty nine. There was thirty cans here. This, you know, that I'm thinking now. This would be nice to decorate those cakes, those fall cakes that you make. That would be really nice. Not thinking about it. I did buy the the, the boxes. I haven't done it yet. She did this fall, fall uh, case for Easter. Really nice guys, Davida. And then I finally found this, Rick Garay collection, whatever, Ray Garay, Richard Garay, sorry. It's the Manly Man, a place for everything. I'm looking for another one that the, they had that has a nice saints, and I'm probably going to have to go to Port Charlie to pick it up, but it has the watch and uh, the glasses. It's like a, like a drawer. You can see the drawer. This is the dots here, and it's like if you pull in the drawer, and it has all the display. This is another drawer, drawer, drawer. It has glasses and it has the pens, the watch, the bows, the tumble tie, and belts and the cufflinks. Another tie, and I don't know what else in there. But it's nice for a men's uh, card. And then I got this uh, Dina Wakely Media stamp. And this one was $3.99. This was $3.99. If you guys need numbers, let me know. <laughs> Listen, media, I'll be in touch. This is from Tuesday morning, media. This is that for Michaels. Michael, I haven't seen Michaels in a while. I haven't been there. They had the grab bags, and I didn't even bother because I don't want to end up with a bunch of stuff that I don't know what to do with it. I like to sort like that. What's her name? Uh, Bible scratch. She said you have when you go to Tuesday morning. She said you have to sort and scratch. And uh, what does she say? Sort and something. She she's so cool. And Tuesday morning they're gonna be coming. Uh, tre Cherish Treasure was sh showing a video. I think the Gemini is coming to Tuesday morning. Mine didn't have it. But I know down in the other, by California and Texas, they're already putting that. That's the, that she was showing it. It's going to, they is equipped with everything for $149, guys. So if you want a Gemini, that's the best machine. I have it here. I love my machine. <clears throat> it's so easy to use. It's easier than the big shot. You don't have to figure out so many plates. Okay, so that's that bag. And... The last one, guys. Looks like a lot, but it's not. I picked up two banners. This I'm going to go outside because let me pull this out. 
for Halloween. It says welcome. Four ninety nine. That's the. This is the only place I can find banners. They are reasonable price and the quality is good because I've been to Walmart, Hobby Lobby, everywhere else. You find it the same quality but a little more. So this one. It's not the mini, it's the same. What are you talking about, Linda? So $4.99, look how pretty, for Halloween. So this is gonna go out tonight. Where's the other one? And of course, my kitty cat. Uh, I inherited a cat, guys, a homeless cat, and I like it because I feed her. She comes in, she goes does her business somewhere, and then she comes back. And then she goes to sleep in the night. Pick this one up. What does this one say? Happy Halloween. And it's a kitty cat with the boots. $4.99. So basically, this is funny because this was drawn. Now that I'm looking at this, is by Charla Fultz. And it says, All right, we serve. So this has uh, rights on this. And this one was uh, Andrea Tashira. It says, all right, reserve. So whoever, the drawing on this, this will be nice to make a pillow too. You take a piece of that fabric that I bought and make pillows. Wouldn't be nice. They're soft. They're really soft. And they're like, um, let me see what are they made of. Um, they're made out of... I can see. This is coming from Richmond, Virginia. They have over 700. Well, Evergreen is pleased to offer over 700 exclusive flag designs in both regular and garden size. But it doesn't say what are they made of. So, but they're soft. Like them. I'm very particular about this. Um, this fell for $2.99 from the DIY craft. You can never have enough felt. So I figured for the holiday, these colors will be nice. And this one has 10 counts. The size is 9 inches by 12 inches. So 9 by 12. And it's nice felt. Let's see. Yeah, it's stiff, it's stiff felt, which is good to cut. Because if you get that, that flimsy one, you can only use it. So I got that one. Got the black and white. Ten counts. If you need numbers, let me know, guys. Picked up this gloss enamel reusable sticker or stencil. This has... Wine, it says bean, in, in, I guess it has a table and a Bristol table. It has like a cooking thing, a cake, Bristol. I don't know what this is. And it has a cake, the spoon, the fork, and the macarons. And this one was $1.99 for this one. Then I got this flower. Did I miss anybody? Say hello, hello everybody. Then I picked up for my eyes only, guys. <laughs> this was a dollar ninety nine, and it's eyes, all different kind of faces. See, so if you want to draw a face, you just put the stencil over the face, and you can make it perfect, or you can spray it. This was a dollar ninety nine. It's twelve inches by three inches. So big media stencil. And who made this? Using sprays. It doesn't say. You know, deco art. And the number for this one. Let me give it to you guys because I know you haven't seen this one. You've seen everything else. Two zero one three zero zero seven. Two dollar ninety nine. Then I found this corner black photo corners. By Sticky Thumb, $1.99, dollar They're little corners. So each corner, when you do anything in a photo or something, you can stick this and you can put the photo there. 
and he has how many? 204 pieces. So I'm assuming he has another one in the back. Then I found this mink stencil for $1.99. And it's about, all the things is about love. The glare, guys, the glare. They should sell something for glare. It has love, the question mark with a star. This one is a nice thick stencil. Plastic, nice, nice, and everything nice. Then I got that was a that was how much was that one? That ninety nine. This one I'm gonna uh, is two thousand forty nine cents. This is pretty. One stencil. Look how pretty. It's also plastic. It's not the flimsy plastic like this one. This is plastic too, but this is more flimsy. It's like a rubbery plastic. This is a stiffer plastic, which is I like better. So made by Mink, and this was two forty nine for this one. Let me keep digging here. Then I got uh, this dress mix media heavy stock, eight by ten sheets, and this is by Rangers. Ten pieces in here for two ninety nine, and wow, this is thick. It says oh, this is the paper is by Ranger, and this is a Tim Holtz dress mix media heavy stock. It's a durable. It's one hundred ten pounds, smooth surface that can be all paint more. The heavyweight surface stands up for your favorite wet and dry distress techniques, making the creative possibilities endless. Mixed media heavy stock is the ideal for die cutting. So you can even die cut on this. You can use Tim Holtz distress markers, crayons, stains, and paint. And it says Tim Holtz water brush and cuts and paper punches. So you can basically, well, you know Tim Holtz makes the best. And this was only $2.99. For ten of the twenty of the ten of the sheets, I don't think that's bad. This stuff is good. Anything that basically. So I got two packages of those. Sorry. Then I got this bird. Butterflies. And the ladybug stencil. Should I keep digging in this bag, guys? <laughs> What are you saying? Dice, that dice. You understand me, girl. Spell it, D-I-E-S. I can spell it and you try, you're going to be sitting there trying to figure out what I'm saying. You're lucky that I'm speaking before. I, seven years ago, I couldn't even say boo. <laughs> you love me anyway. Got the bird. Can you see the bird? Burn the branches, and he has another stencil here. I hate that glare. See? This was a dollar ninety-nine by Haiti swap Haiti swap. Then I found some numbers from DIY shop for $1.99. I, I get I hate that glare, my goodness. There you go. Okay, computer. Oh computer. I just so I got that. Oh, I picked up, I don't, oh, this is the, the pastel colors of that stiff foam. And it says here, guys, this is not a toy. <laughs> For $2.99, it has white, greens, all the white, greens, pinks, purple, and blues. Pastel colors. Let me see what else I got here. Let me keep taking it here. Did I get numbers? Yeah. Okay. Got this, um, this were 40%. These are like um, heart, uh, what do you call that? Push pins from AC. What is it, AC, whatever. 
American craft. It was $2.49. I got it from the clearance. The little hearts. And this ones, you oh my goodness, they're so cute. This is for planners. It's two pens. But they they the two pens, one is pink and the other one's like a minty creek color. And they that's how they write. And they're kitty cats. See? Okay. Let me get them out of here. Garbage can. Can you see? Oh, say, can you see? Here we go. The kitty cat's face. And they're supposed to write the same. Yep, they write green. See? Of course, I had some tons of paper around and then writing on my hands. And this one writes pink. Adorable. See? Pink and green. Beautiful. This goes in my collection of Okay, let's see. Oh, found another pen. It's a stylo with a diamond. A girl can't have too many diamonds. Oops, you can't even see it. There you go. This was a dot two forty nine for this one. And how much was the other one? I don't even know. Keep going in here. This is a Tim Holt Textures Fade. What is it? Embossing folder. And it's a tree. And this one was $1.99. And this is a good price for this. Cute. Without for Halloween. Look how pretty. You imagine that you take foil, black foil, and put it in there and run it to the machine, or you can do this part. Me, what I'll do, I'll paint inside here, forget about the machine, and I'll just squeeze it together, rub it, and make it together. <laughs> yeah, the bird census is cute, Mary. Okay, so this one is by Tim Holtz, and it was. A dollar ninety nine. This is a dollar ninety nine for this. This is good. You know, guys, I I'm, I'm sitting here showing you guys all this stuff, and in my heart, what I feel is, I wish I can have taken and send one thing, the the joy that one of, everything that I have, I could send one of each to you guys. That's how I wish I could do. You know what I'm saying? That's what's in my heart and my thoughts. I'm going through it. I say, yeah, I'm sharing this with them. But some of you guys, I don't know if you are able to get it or or stuff like that. You know what I mean? So sometimes I feel bad showing things because I don't know. You know, everybody has different needs. Anyway, that's me. I'm just thinking here. Then I, I got picked up these trees. Not that I need them, but I know they can be painted. So that's why I picked up a bag. They were $3.99, a little pricey for this. But there's one, two, three, four, five. You can paint them black, you can paint them green, or any color, you know. You can cut them in half. Now, for the the Tim Holtz collection for Christmas, is they're gonna he's gonna have these trees are gonna be cut in half. So he's gonna be selling them cut in half too. So he was showing that the other day. I was looking at that stuff. And then the last thing I picked up. Is that the last thing? Yeah. The last thing, guys. Almost, oh my goodness, an hour and a half. Oh, listen to her. You know, cats so sometimes I, I, I'll get lucky, I guess, because I'm constantly searching around things and going. I guess I pick up the right thing. The best times I go there, I don't find anything. I find one thing or two things. That's about it. And I complain and, and to the manager because she knows me already. But so anyway, so I picked this up. And the reason I picked this up is like a punch. And this is what it does. It, you, it cuts like this, but you can turn it into uh, a glow punch. 
like you can put lights in it. Let me see if I can get it out of here. I was looking at it and I said, oh, that's that's neat. I mean, you may, maybe the machine, you might get a, a something or like some people have the Cricut and all those machines that you can do all this kind of stuff, but I'd rather have it punch. It's easier for my brain. Okay. So basically, I guess, do you remember that eight punch that I shared with you guys during the summer, the, the number eight that everybody was looking, uh, that I found the green, I found green, the yellow, the purple, and the pink. No, I didn't find the yellow. I found the green, the pink, and the purple. I didn't find the yellow one. That does the border of the thing, the border of the doilies. So this is similar. See, you cut it, you cut like that, and once it's cut like that, the page, and that, then you interlock them together, and they turn into a little globe like this. It kind of looked like a, a Chinese cookie, you know? But you can put little things, like you can make, I don't think it's going to be, a, how big is this? Let me see, this is my American craft. This is, um, it's, uh, let's see the size. The way they're showing it here, they put, they made the glove and they slide the, the, the lights inside and you can hang it and make a, a, a string banner across. But you can put things in there too, like candy or you can put a little a present for somebody or something, I don't know. I haven't done it yet, so I don't know how big it is, but I figure I'll pick it up and this is, it says it creates mini gloves with our adhesive. So basically you interlock each other. So I'm assuming, the ones, since he has these things, I keep this here because you need to do, you know. It cuts, yeah, you start in the corner. See here, like any other punch, it's a corner punch. And it cuts, and I guess you turn it the other way, and then you do the same thing until you get all this, and then you interlock it together. It's by me, we're memory keeper. I thought to pick it up, hey, for $4.99 DIY. And then that's the last item, guys, that I had to share with you guys. Now, let me show you some of the pictures that I took, if you don't mind, of some of the stuff that I, um, oh, I have these two pumpkins I forgot to show you guys that I almost broke. This one I picked up, yeah, from Tuesday morning. And it goes like that with the green. And this one... I broke, but I put it together here. And this one's hollow inside. And this was a $7.99. So I paid a pretty penny for this one, but I it fell and it broke the tip over here. So, but I'm not gonna throw it out. So I'll paint it, I'll fix it, and I keep it. Hey, whoever wants to come to my house and criticize, too bad. All right, let me see if I can show you guys the cats that I inherit. <sighs> Who's this? <laughs> okay, hold on a second. Uh, let me see. Let me see if I can show you guys. Okay, this is the kitty that I inherit. Let me see if you can see it. That's her. Her name. We name her Oreo because she has white legs. You can hardly see it there. Let me see if I can enlarge it. The glare doesn't let you see. Anyway, that's her. She has white legs and a white bottom and white paws. So she, when you look at her, it looks like she has socks in her back legs and little glo white gloss in her paws in the front. And she's so adorable. <laughs> she's so cute. And the most beautiful green eyes. Then, this is one of the wreaths that I made. Oops. I hate that glare. I can't see. I'm trying to bring it in a way that you guys can see it. But you're going to see it once I do the video, but I just wanted to give you a little glimpse of it. Remember the garland that I had? Look, can you see it there? The bow.
There we go. Let me see. The camera is adjusting. Okay. That's the one of the garlands. Then I did this one. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to show you. I did that one. You can't appreciate it well. Let me see if I put a shadow over it. <laughs> put a shadow over here. An umbrella. You can't hardly see it, guys. Um, and then, where else did I go? This is the one in my living room. I'm so sorry. I want to show you guys, but I can't. I'm gonna, I guess you guys are gonna have to wait until I do the video. Uh, no. There you go. You can barely appreciate it because it's, it's shadowing. Thank you. So you can't see it well, but once I do the video, yeah. And then I'm gonna show you these guys, but don't 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 feel bad. This is my dog in my room. That's how bad he was doing. He was bleeding and everything, so. I had to put him out of his misery. This is when we took him to the bed. He was walking around thinking he was going to come home. I don't think you can see that one, but. <sighs> anyway, let me see. Oh, this is part of my fireplace here. I I'm going to post them in. Um... What is this? Uh, oh, this is the one I did for Halloween for the Vidas Challenge. The Halloween one. I'm so sorry. You guys can't see it. Just a little bit. Can you see? <laughs> a little better. That's the, that's the one. Oh, sorry. Got erased. Oh, I see what the problem is. You have to put a shadow over the camera. I know I get you. Somehow I learned lighting techniques over here. This is part of the challenge for the Vita's uh, tear tray. Let me see the other one. You can't appreciate it well, but a little bit. You can see. Let me see if you can see this one better now. There's a good. Those are some plates that I have in the thing. The wall, Dollar Tree plates, and the uh, here one together. <laughs> and that's all I'm gonna show you guys. <laughs> so I'm gonna be doing the, the the video hopefully this week, so you guys can see. I'm probably gonna do the whole Halloween thing. I don't know. Yeah, if you saw the picture, he, he wasn't doing well. And God knows we gave him bath, took care of his blood thing, and all that kind of stuff, you know. So what the heck is this? Okay. So so that's all I have, guys, for you. Thank you for your love and your support. Just keep praying for me because I still miss him. I am trying to make the best out of it. So with that being said... Any questions you guys might have? I was wondering, you know, I, I do, you guys never ask me, and you know, stuff. I mean, so I see some people that do Q and A's and stuff like that. If you guys have any questions, let me know. You know, see if I can answer or not. <laughs> Who knows <laughs> if I remember? So that's all I had, guys, for you. I mean, I think it's plenty. We're here for what an hour. 49 minutes. Thank you so much for coming by. Share if you think, you know, anybody is interested in watching. And uh, don't forget to bring that thumbs up. If you, I mean, it doesn't do it. It doesn't mean anything. I just saying. And uh, I love you guys. And uh, I'll keep you in prayers and hope you keep in your prayers. And I have my email in the, in my description bar, in my description, in my channel. 
If you go to about, about, you will see my emails. You want to email me, you know, I'll be glad to talk to you guys. So good night, Sarah. Thank you for stopping by, sweetie. Good night, Judy. Good night, Mary. Thank you so much. Good night, Linda. Well, I'm going to be going, uh, I'm going to be off for a little bit. So if you want to text the Vita, you can text me, you know, we can text back and forth, whatever, if you want to. Anyway, guys, thank you so much. I hope you enjoy the uh, things that I show you. I hope you guys can get your hands on anything you might like. From here, I bring you the prices and the stores. Hopefully, you're able to, you know, find something. Crafty Kitty, hello, sweetie. I didn't even see you come in, honey. Was so busy. Yeah, I named her Oreo. Actually, it was my granddaughter, my younger daughter, that named her Oreo. I didn't see you quite your thing. Yes, yes. She has like uh, Oreo. She has like the front paws are white, like up to here. And when she she doesn't show her nails. Her, her legs are real long, but they're, they're so beautiful. They're, it's a beautiful cat. And so when she sits, she sits like this, and then her legs are long. Like, a, like I was, I've never seen cats with long legs like that, except this one. And then she has, her legs are like up to here, and then white up to here. Like she has, you know, those stockings that we used to use years ago, <laughs> up to here. But, you know, like uh, when, before the companion hose came, like that, they're white. And then the rest, and then the bottom here is white, like she has a tuxedo, and the rest is black, pure black. And then her eyes are that, that green, beautiful green. So, which one we saw on checker paper? Yeah. Salt and checker paper. The one with the the witches, the witch, or the one with the cat? The one. Let me take my shoe off. My shoe is bothering me. Let's see. There you go. The cats are from Burlington. These are from Burlington Co Factory. And they were $3.99. And the witches were from the witch legs and the cauldron. They were from Tuesday morning. I love this one. There's these kitties. They're so cute. Let me see what the other ones are. Yeah. This one was four ninety nine from Tuesday morning. This is the one that has the. The witch's cauldron, and uh, is that what you wanted to know, Miria? Good night, Mary Ellen. <laughs> it's a Linda. <laughs> and then this one, the kitty cats. They were at Burlington. And these were $3.99. They were cheaper than the other ones. I think two of them are sometimes go overboard. The kitty, then two cats, a white one, salt and pepper. Look at the faces, it'll go. And this one. So this one, this one must have, I think I guess it's because of the brand. Let's see. It doesn't say, let's see. You can go, it says here, uh, you can go to www, and then it says DEI direct.com together. DEI direct.com for this one. 
or Tuesday morning, one or the other. Then this one, which is the cats, salt and pepper, is by B BW. I don't know who they are. And the website is www.bsinboywtc.com. And it's Sugar Skull Chihuahua. Sh I'm calling them cat, they're dogs, guys. <laughs> I'm thinking they're cat, they're chihuahuas. Oh, my God. They're chihuahuas, but they look like cats to me. Don't they look like cats? <laughs> Don't they look like cats? I think I'm reading here, they're dogs. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Dumb boy. This was a chihuahua, guys. It says here that I read in the package. I sold you this as a cat, and then she, they look like cats to me. They don't look like no chihuahuas to me. So, but according to this, they're chihuahuas. And it says here Sugar Skull Chihuahuas, Salted Checker Paper 2. And it has a no model number 78313. And the website is www.bsinboywtc.com. In case you're interested. All right, we serve. So they're chihuahuas, guys. They're not cats. <laughs> After a while, they start looking about. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay, now this we know this is a cauldron and these are legs, so that you can have no doubt about that. Oh my goodness! So that's that. What was this? Oh, we just like okay, we put this in here before I break that. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious, that's so funny. Anyway. Live and learn. Well, learn and live, or live and learn. How do you go? What happened here? This is all just this. This is all to the head. Talk to the hand, or the head doesn't know what you're saying. <laughs> oh, goodness. Now, this belongs here. Why don't you want to go in there? And these are chihuahuas, guys, not cats. Oh, brother, they're going to have to, whoever watches every run of this, is going to have to wait to the end to find out that they're dogs. <laughs> there you go. I'm thinking they're cats. Goodness. They look like cats to me, so they're going to be cats. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, girls, tomorrow is well, it's the Sunday. What time is it? Oh, it's, not, it's only 11 o'clock here. Um, Sunday night. I guess next week, I guess I'll be. See if I can do the video of the two, the tier for the Vita. And I know it was due yesterday, the Vita. I do apologize for that. But I, you know, like I was telling Linda, I was like, drag well, I was telling you too, I was dragging my, my covers around the house, like we say in Spanish. <laughs> and it had no energy whatsoever to do anything. I just, one of those things, you know. I was doing things here to keep my mind busy, but like coming on live. I like to bring you guys joy, not sadness, you know, though I will tell you what's going on, but not because I want you guys to feel sorry or anything like that. It's just part of sharing with you guys. So what are you talking about? Okay, what's that? What are you guys talking about? Names. You guys, what are you guys talking about? The names of what? Boy, Walton. Look at Linda. Edith researched the names. Thank you, Linda, for that. I really appreciate it. I actually took encouragement from you and some of more of the people that are telling me, you know, I was talking to them that behind it, you know. 
Sometimes we need our friends to just push you a little bit, you know? Uh, it's part of the dwelling. It's part of the moaning, mooring, mooring, whatever that word is. So. Okay, guys. I guess I'll be seeing you guys sometime next week. Let's see what I have come up with. So. Okay. Yeah, I know. Really? So funny you saying that, Sarah, because I got so for mail from Judy and uh, also from Nina, and it's been not even the it's been sitting there. I haven't even opened it. It's just like because I have to share with you guys. That's nice. Thank you. I really appreciate it, Sarah. If you didn't notice, nice. What is that? What is a Walton, uh, uh, Sarah? Isn't that uh, uh, the bakery stuff? <laughs> That's what I know, Walton, the bakery. Actually, Michael's had all the bakery stuff on clearance. <laughs> <laughs> A DVD. Hey, thank you, Davida. Pray for you too. I was listening to something before I came on about these people were talking about that when people when people that you love are gone, why why don't they communicate with everybody? And the guy that was he was saying that we here as human, we have to go through certain things to learn certain things. And they like they have their own world there doing their things, and we have our things to do here. It's like a computer. Um, we, we synchronize with each other, even though we're part of each other, but yet we have work to do here, and they have their stuff to do there. And then when we go, we cross over, then we meet with them there. That's what they, they, they were talking about, basically. And if if uh, he was saying that if we try to com if they try to communicate with us, that will they, they will in, uh, interrupt the rhythm of what we're supposed to do here. So that's why not that many people, uh, like some people, have got, uh, gotten to a point that they have communicated with loved ones or the loved ones have communicated with them, and not everybody does it. So uh, sometimes they do it with like a third party even in dreams or something like that, because uh, like if you lost somebody so much, so like a husband or a child or something like that, it would be harder for you to deal with it than a third party coming and telling you. So I guess but my dog cannot bark. So animals, I guess animals go into a different realm because they don't have souls. We are different. That's what we're talking, that's what they were talking about. I was new to watching this. I don't know why these things keep popping up. I guess to let me know that it's okay, I guess. That's the way I take it. Finding the lost cat, it was the way of God being human. Say, listen, you're gonna, you, your pet is going to go with me, but I'm leaving you somebody else. Uh, go on YouTube, and I come across... It's not, I'm not even registered to this channel, subscribe to this channel. They're popping up and talking about what I'm feeling at this moment or what I'm going through, and they're, they're giving me answers. I guess that's the way God communicated. This is the way I think. This is, I guess God, I want an answer, so he's giving me answers through other parties, through YouTube. That's the way I'm seeing it. So I get, to give me that peace, because that's what I'm saying, give me the, the peace that I, that, that I can confront, conform to. I know that he has to go. I know I have to let him go. I know we have to... Whatever we love, we have to let them go. It's a temporary thing. It's not forever. We got we 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 were made a promise, 
and he's going to keep that promise. Because I kept questioning. I said, why God? Why God? So he has a way of answering me, and he has given me plenty of answer. Um, it's so funny because sometimes you doubt about well, this and that because you are so hurt. But this has been an experience. Even though he's just my dog, it's been an experience. And um, he talks to you in different ways. You just have to listen. And I, I sit in the lanai and I watch you too, and all of a sudden these things start popping up and this and that. And I say, oh, wow. You know, or sometimes I sit down in the lanai. You might, I might, I might sound like crazy, but I'm not crazy. It's just, and I'm, and I, and I see there's no birds around because the weather, you know, like you observe animals and they let you know what the weather is going to be like. Um, like if it's going to rain, you see how the birds start gathering themselves on the lighting, uh, a stretch of the lighting poles, whatever, and they all gather them to the rain comes, and then once the rain is gone, they go flying or they hide in the bushes, observing what's around you. We have to be more observant. We're so busy with everything else that we don't, I don't know, I, I must be getting old. I don't know. <laughs> I still seeing things, yeah. Right. Well, according to what I heard, read in the Bible that says, into the judgment time, there's, there's no, we, we, I guess all souls go back and our spirit becomes dormant into the judgment time. That's what I was reading in the Bible. So I don't want to get into that because I'm not a, a, a perfectionist too. I'd rather, you know, I'd rather think what I read there, I understand it the way I did. So it, at least I'm at peace because death is something that's hard to take from by anybody. But it's also a joyful time. Um, who, who they were saying, they said, some. I don't know who was, the, I heard this somewhere, they said that when a person is born, we should cry more than when a person is gone, when they die, because they're going to back to the maker and to judgment time. And then... Uh, people who are born and come into this world to be tortured and suffering and everything else. So we should cry for whoever, for baby being born. That's what they say. But we do the opposite, you know? I think we all do it, Linda. One way or the other, talk to the tree or talk to that. Or talk, I mean, I used to talk to King. And he would look at me like, lady, I don't understand what you're saying. That's not dog talk. Yeah, actually, people can. It's, you're right, Sarah. They sometimes people say they think that they're talking to the dead. They don't, but they forget about the fallen angels. They can disguise themselves and make believe that they're talking to a relative. I agree with you on that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, all the animals have no sense, so they're gonna go up to the maker. All animals, he loved all the animals and the children. <laughs> well, I can't wait to see things are the prophecies are being fulfilled, so I don't know. Being being godly or not being godly, the, the well it's written is written. That's all I can tell you. All the stuff that goes crazy around the world. The hurricanes, the earthquakes, and uh, the tornadoes, the tsunamis, the typhoons, all that stuff, all those animals that are showing dead in the, the coast because the sea is being polluted, all that stuff. The earth is, uh, what did they say that the earth is going to moan like a woman in birth or something like that? We see in it. She's expulsing everything out, all the junk that we put in it. We just had to, at least I had to hang from something to have that hope and not let the hope go, you know? It's been rough seven years. For the past seven years, it's been, though I had a, a, a you know, my life hasn't been easy, but the past seven years has been one thing after the other. Last year was uh, family members and tragic accidents, uh, our stuff, uh, now the dogs, and so... But you keep going. Yeah, the weather is weird. Yeah, everything has been raining, 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 raining. It doesn't stop. Yeah. 
I truly believe that man, man's hand is involved into that weather stuff. If they can feel, this is what I was telling. I don't know who I was saying this to. If they can make form a hurricane in the laboratory, that makes you think that they cannot generate something in the coast of Africa and let nature take over. Because once you start mixing the mixture, the atmosphere is. All you need is the atmosphere. It become larger. This is my 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 thinking here, or maybe I'm nuts too. <laughs> but I think man has a lot to do with all that stuff. They're not telling all the truth. He will send them again. Uh, yeah, I, I truly believe that. Uh, I don't think, uh, I think it was somebody I was talking to that says, he does not give you something you cannot handle. Yes, are you going to feel bad and you're going to go through the whole hurdle of the pain? But you know what? At the long run, you overcome it because God knows your strength. God knows what he gives you, you know? Is it easy? No, nobody says it's going to be easy, but it makes you, it doesn't, it's not like it makes you hard or heartless. It's just it makes you stronger, I guess. And then you start handling things in a different, you start seeing things in a different perspective. I don't know. Yeah, it's called life, honey, Judy. You're right. And we don't know until we, we're gone. But if, the way I look at it, that must be very good because I haven't seen nobody return from there. So it must be good over there on the other side, better than here. At least the people who say they're gone and come back, they say it's really nice, they don't want to come back. So let's believe that. <laughs> Thank you, Linda. Well, guys, I'm going to end up this year. It's been two hours since I've been talking here in my head. Oh, this is terrible, two hours. But I haven't talked to you guys in so long. But I'm glad that everybody's here and in... I'm, I hope you guys enjoy the little share here, and um, I'll be talking to you guys. May the Lord bless all of you, give you the strength to whoever needs it. We all are going to one thing or the other, and it is what it is. This is life, like Judy says. Life is what, what you know, we have to keep going. Well, thank you so much again. I love you guys. Big hug, big kiss, and I'll see you guys soon. I'll be talking to you guys. Take care.